underwire bras cause breast cancer? True or false? False. <laughs> underwire bras do not cause breast cancer. Um, there is no data to suggest that it does. Underwire bras may interfere with the um, overall lymphatic drainage of your breast just because of the nature of a, of a wire pushing against the, the um, you know, the inframammary fold of the under part of your breast. However, there's no direct relationship that any bra has directly caused breast cancer. Okay, what about breast implants? There has not been any evidence to suggest that breast implants causes breast cancer. We do know that there is a breast implant associated lymphoma that does exist. Um, that um, it's actually an anaplastic large cell lymphoma that's breast implant associated. And it's different from breast cancer. This lymphoma is very rare. One in every 100,000 women would be diagnosed with it. I think not even over 100 have been um, documented in this country. Um, so it's a very rare lymphoma that has been associated with breast implants, and that's breast implants whether you're getting it for augmentation purposes or reconstruction post-cancer purposes. What about standing in front of a microwave? Does that increase your chances of breast cancer? Well, if you're standing there indefinitely, yes, it does. <laughs> Most people don't literally stand in front of the microwave all day long. Um, so, you know, microwave by itself, microwaving your dinner does not really increase your risk of breast cancer. You have to have a lot of exposure of radiation from that microwave oven. And when I mean a lot, I mean consistently being exposed to the microwave rays all day long every day for you to have a risk of developing any kind of cancer related to the microwave oven. And with regard to radiation, what are we talking about? We're not just talking of taking one flight or getting one chest x-ray, correct? Correct. We're talking about treatment radiation for cancers. What about dental x-rays in children or a ton of dental x-rays, those kinds of things? Those kind of things have not been shown as of yet to have any increased risk in developing any kind of cancer, let alone breast cancer. Um, there's just not enough um, dosage of radiation for a simple x-ray, whether it's dental or chest. Uh, for it to cause, have a direct cause for breast cancer, um, you have to have a lot of it. You know, we're, you know, in general, we're exposed to radiation every day. Just walking outside, we're exposed to radiation, radiation we don't see, whether it's from the sun itself, whether it's from everyone's um, cell phones, from cars, from buses, there's just radiation all around us. Um, so we have to have very, very high doses that are focused on our body to actually have a direct of cancer. The final myth is that deodorant causes cancer. What's the truth in that? It does not. I am very <laughs> intrigued by this <laughs> response. And that's all I can say about it. <laughs>